well met fellows, it's Wombat, uh, back again with another spicy combo, and this one's kind of like the weird cousin of Spriciness 2 Gravity Iron, but it is Zillion Zeus Knuckle Hunter Dash, which is kind of like a mix between a mixed attacker and almost an anti-attacker, and uh, I'll explain why. So basically the layer Z2, it's uh, got the highest stamina out of most of the attack layers in Classic. I don't know if it's like the absolute most, but it's pretty close if it's not. And it's more uh, burst oriented than KO oriented, unlike S2, making it uh, more suited to bursting opponents rather than KOing them. Uh, the disc is Knuckle, which has a good amount of stamina and burst resistance, and outward weight distribution as well. I've tried it with a bunch of other discs, and Knuckle helped it just move the best, the fastest, so this is probably the, one of the best discs for attack types in Classic. And then uh, Hunter Dash, it might not be as fast or as powerful in terms of KOing ability as Extreme Dash or Quick Dash, but it is the hardest to burst and it has the most stamina and so the easiest to control, meaning that it can kind of balance out uh, Z2's more bursting focused nature to make kind of like a mixed attacker, and just between the stamina of the layer and the driver compared to other attack types, it's plenty capable of outspinning them as well, but can't defeat them through another method. So that pretty much explains the combo. I will uh, show it off in some test battles now. Alright, so up first we're going to be doing Zillion Zeus Knuckle Hunter Dash versus Anubian A2 Knuckle Yard Dash S. Watch so it wouldn't burst, but it's one zero. Next, I'm gonna test it against uh, Wolborg Yell Eternal. That looked like one zero to Z2. Z2 really showing off the all uh, stamina that itself and Hunter Dash has in comparison to other things. Up next, we're gonna do it uh, attack versus attack. This versus uh, Spriggan Limited Extreme Dash.
That looks like a tough And 3-1 to Z2. Alright, now let's show against Edit Barrow, Gravity, Unite. That's a little disappointing 3-1. Um, I was hoping to get a burst, but my Esprit Unite still isn't fully worn down yet, so it will still go aggressive sometimes, which is not good. Alright, and last but not least, let's test it against Yggdria on Y2 Gravity Orbit. It's 1-0-Z2. So overall, uh, Zillion Zeus, Knuckle, 100 Ash, it's overall a pretty good attack type. I want to say it might be like the safest attack type you can use, um, just because it's relatively easy to control using Hunter Dash. It's got a solid amount of stamina, so even if you don't uh, land the KO or the burst early on, you have a decent chance of uh, outspinning them. Um... And it also fares decently well in attack versus attack. Um, you should try to launch a little bit after the opponent and 
tornado stolen away so that they will chase you around rather than running into you head on. So it's because this is better at outspinning opposing attack types rather than defeating them with head on hits as opposed to something like uh, Minoboros or Q2 would. But overall it's um, I don't think it's quite as versatile as Spryzen S2 on Iron, which I compared it to earlier, but overall it's still um, a pretty good attack, mixed attack, anti-attack type combo. Um, definitely try it out. I used it in a recent tournament too, so it's pretty good. Uh, I don't know what else to say, so I'll see you guys next time maybe.